All right, what's up, you guys? This is Devin with Century Effects Studios, back with another video, and today we're going to be talking about something very interesting. Now, I don't know if you've seen this, and yes, it's a little bit dusty here, but this is the uh, Opteca Beauty Dish, and it's designed for speed lights. Now, back in the day when I really first started with beauty dishes, I started with this. This was like one of my first beauty dishes. And a lot of people are probably going to be using something like this as their first beauty dish. This is an all-in-one type of uh, speed light bracketing mount. Like, you literally mount your speed light to this beauty dish. You might be saying to yourself, Devin, well, why don't you have this with you to show us? Well, it broke. <laughs> well, it's very cumbersome. Um, one of the best things and worst things about it is that it's not designed to be taken apart too much. The only thing you can really take apart on this thing is the actual adapter, the dish itself. You can, you know, replace it with a snoot. But other than that, the only thing you can actually do is take that center plate out. You can't actually break it down to the point where you can actually store it in a spot that's not designated for it because this is really all they give you when you first get the actual beauty dish. And since this is all they give you, it's not actually designed for storage. As a matter of fact, this box is really, really big. It's hard to travel with this box. Now, I didn't want to get a expensive, custom-built Pelican box just for a $30 speed light attachment, which turned into a beauty dish. And even though I did a lot of stuff with this beauty dish, I didn't take good care of it at all. I'm going to just be honest with you guys because it's just not easy to carry around. It's unlike other beauty dishes in my soft boxes. My soft boxes came with cases, my uh, Easy Lock, Easy Glow, that parabolic uh, sep hexagonal soft box. It has its own bag and it's huge. It's 37 inches you know, whatever it's called, but it's a soft box. It's huge. It comes from uh, Adorama's brand, Glow, I believe, and it has its own bag, and I don't have to necessarily worry about lugging it around or it getting damaged or it damaging me. One of the biggest problems with this speed light beauty dish thing is that it's made out of metal. It's like some cheap kind of... I don't know, they just really just etched it out of metal. Nothing's really like smoothened out all that well. So it's really easy for your finger to get caught in some part of the metal. And when that finger gets caught in some part of the metal, you start to bleed sometimes. It gets that bad. That metal's pretty sharp. But if you can get over all that stuff with this beauty dish, you can get some great results. Now, like I said, I don't have a beauty dish on me, but I did make a video using this uh, speed light. Well, not this speed light, but this speed light adapter with my young new old 600 EXRT and uh, wirelessly triggering this. I took I, didn't, I went on a photo shoot with Carice, but that video is actually on my channel and I'm going to link it here up up here somewhere so you guys are able to actually see what this beauty dish can do it's a decent product i'm not gonna say it's perfect but the lack of the ability to be able to store it in a nice spot the actual it cutting me sometimes like i'm like you're abusing me so i'm gonna abuse you i mean because when you're in the field and you gotta work and you got time constraints you don't have time to be sitting around you know, fiddling with some of this stuff. You need some easy, on-the-go type of stuff. Now, for those of you who are in the studio all the time, and this can be set up, and you can sit it off, and you don't have to worry about it, maybe even put a speed light into it and then sit it to the side, and then when you're ready, just pull it out and just move it in place, that might be perfect for you. But for those of us who need, like, to move from place to place to place, break down equipment, put stuff up, do this, that, and the other, move from place to place, it is not all that great as far as the usability of it. It's not easy to use, but once you get it in the right spot and you have that light going, I think within four or five feet, sometimes I stretch that, maybe for an artistic effect. But check out that video, see what you think about the lighting quality that you get manifested through this beauty dish and see if that's something you want to buy. I'm done with Century Effect Studios. This is my opinions on this speed light 
uh, uh, speed ring type of beauty dish attachment here. It's it's not. It's just my opinions. Most of us have speed lights. Most of us want cheaper alternatives when it comes to lighting and modifying our lighting. So chances are we're gonna come past this Optica beauty dish, and it did good pictures for me. I like the pictures, nice and contrasty. But see if your miles vary the same, and if you got any comments. Let me know in the comment box below. I'm done with Centrifex Studios. Stay tuned for the next video.